My friends, this is probably the most expensive towel that I have ever owned in my life. So if you wanna hear my thoughts on what I think about this $40 towel, as well as this $80 blanket, then just keep watching. Originally, when I first heard about Kirkies, they were only a slipper company. And about a year ago, they sent me four of their slippers to review. So I made a review on them talking about the pros, the cons, my honest thoughts about the slippers. And more recently, they reached out to me and said, hey, we have some new products. We have a towel and we have a blanket. Would you be interested in reviewing them? And I said, sure. I also have a discount or affiliate link down in the description box. So check that out. First, let's start with the towel shall we? So this is officially called a peshmetal, pesh, peshmetal, peshtamol, peshtamol. These types of towels have been around for hundreds of years. They used to be used in the Mediterranean and in like ancient Turkish bathhouses. And I can definitely see why, because I feel like these are the type of towel where you'd want to kind of show it off a little bit. It's a very flat weave, so it's different than a typical terry cloth towel that it's very fluffy and big. It's made out of 100% cotton. Um, there's a few different standards on it as well that basically means that it doesn't have added chemicals. So I really appreciate that, especially since it is so close to your skin skin. These towels can also be washed in the washing machine, which is nice. And I had no problems with it. I put it on a natural cycle. I also dried it on warm and had no problems with that. I was kind of worried about the tassels not making it through the washing machine, but I didn't have any problems with that whatsoever. And to be honest, it just cut softer every time I washed it. The only problem I ran into with the towel is, I'm going to be honest, it was not that absorbent. Um, I think it's something about the flat weave, but I just did not find it really compared to my normal terry cloth towels that I use to dry my hands and dry my body after I shower or take a bath. I think this towel is really better suited to for things where it doesn't need to absorb a lot of water. So I think it would be great to like bridge the beach, you know, lay out on a beach chair or on the sand. I think it would be great as like a beach cover up to wear almost like as an article of clothing or as like a shawl or something like that. I think you could even use it as like a yoga towel or even as like a miniature blanket um, because it's pretty lightweight and I think it really could be good for that. In a lot of ways, the blanket is pretty much the same as the towel, but it is basically twice the price and twice the size. The type of material is very, very similar. It has, it still has this 100% cotton, like thin, like flat weave kind of material. So it's very similar to the towel here. The only real difference I would say, other than the size and stuff that I talked about is the, the tassels are a little bit different. Like the tassels are slightly bigger. And then the other thing is the fabric feels like slightly different. I can't tell if this is just my head or if it's actually different, but it feels like a little bit softer, a little bit more like fuzzy feeling. Here's kind of what I like about the blanket. It is very lightweight and I think it is the perfect like California winter blanket. It's pretty thin, so it's like perfect to just like you want something covering you up, but you don't want to be like weighed down in like a giant parka made into a blanket. It's also really pretty and like nice for like decorative things. Like you can put it on your bed, you can put it on your couch. It just looks put together and just kind of like professional. If there was such a thing as a professional blanket, I feel like this would be it. It just like looks very put together. It's really like lightweight, easy to transport. I think it's like a perfect lightweight blanket to bring out to like a bonfire or something. I think this would be also make a really nice gift for someone like maybe for like a Mother's Day gift, like graduation gift, since those kind of fall in the summer. And I feel like that's the kind of the kind of time of year when I feel like this would be really best suited. Just a few negatives to just point out is number one, it is 100% cotton. So it does like, it does get a little bit wrinkly. And then, as I said, this is a lightweight blanket. It is more of like a summertime, like warm weather blanket. If you are looking for something that is like hefty, 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 like super warm, cozy, it's, this is not the blanket for you. It is, it's just not that. Like the material itself, is not super like fuzzy. It's a little bit more so than a towel, but it's not, it doesn't have like a super plush feeling to it. And then also it's just thinner. So it's not gonna keep you super warm, but um, yeah, those are kind of my thoughts on the blanket. So if you check this out, remember to check the description box. I do have a discount code down there for you. And until next time, bye.